what's up everybody welcome back to my channel i wanted to film like a little get ready with me today like get ready with me makeup routine what the fuck it is what the fuck is this what the fuck it is yes yeah i'm like a real girl and stuff like i get pimples anyways yeah i'm just gonna show you guys my recent go-to makeup routine so fucking annoying anyways yeah um i don't know to be honest i don't put like oh god here i go sounding like a like a pick me no stop i'm not saying it like that by the way i straightened my hair yesterday i blow dried and straightened it which i usually don't do i only did it yesterday because i had a shower okay why don't i just talk about this while i'm doing my makeup hold on so to prime my face i'm literally just going to use moisturizer i'm yet to find a primer that i think does anything and this is my favorite moisturizer ever it's the skin fix um, peptide moisturizer you it's so funny i will not wear makeup to work because we still wear masks so and i go to work after this so i'm literally doing this just as a video for you guys and then i'm literally gonna take all the makeup off and go to work like what the fuck it's just the dedication i guess okay so while that is like setting and shit um we're gonna start with the eyes okay so i love this makeup bag by the way no i'm not telling you where i got it from so i'm gonna put concealer on the eyes as like a base i'm gonna use the one size concealer from i think it's patrick star um anyways so what was I saying? Okay, so I strained my hair yesterday and blue dry it because um, I thought I could like not wash my hair before work and like get away with it. And then I was like, no, it literally looks like fucking literal shit. So I was like, no, I can't get away with like not washing it. And then by the time I decided to shower again and wash it, I was like, ooh, we're a little a little close to work so i knew my hair went dry in time so i blue dry it and straightened it and i'm like oh fuck it looks like so good straight like frizz what the fuck is frizz no no i don't have frizzy hair what this is my natural hair i can't with that fucking ugliest pimple it really is ugly like mm. and then for okay i'm like gonna come off really bad at eyeshadow so i try to do like as little eyeshadow as possible but i'm gonna take the tarte la toasted palette um the only looks i ever put on my eyes are brown brown so this is what the pal this is what the palette looks like i'm gonna use s'more the shade s'more which is that first color Ooh. and i'm just going to just like set my eyes set the concealer this fucking bitch i can't why is she staring at me like that do you see her it's like mind your business hello she's still staring i don't get it she's so fucking cute help Okay, and then I'm gonna do I'm gonna do this shade right here, which is cashmere and like that, and then I'm gonna blend that or try to. We'll see. And then I'm gonna do some of cozy, which is this one. Um, anyways, I was working um earlier today. And I don't know, I was just, I'm just, I was just in such a fucking foul and um, awful mood. Like, I don't know, everything my manager was doing was just pissing me the fuck off. Um, surprisingly, the customers weren't pissing me off. Like, the customers were, like, not the fucking problem today, which is rare. It was just the manager was just pissing me off. And I was already annoyed, and I went back to, like, prep. For when I come back at night so like re restock like stuff basically 
and I open up the fridge and I go to like take out like lemon slices right and tell me why the whole fucking shelf literally okay why am I like not doing my makeup as if like I have time um the whole motherfucking shelf falls over and there's like a bunch of shit on the shelf and it literally just falls everywhere and then I have to spend 10 extra minutes that I could have been closing the back cleaning up granted I could have just asked but it's, I can't sorry I could have just asked the kitchen chef to help why is she still looking hmm. I could have asked the kitchen chef to help me but I just like didn't want to like they're so nice and like help all the time so I was like Ugh, I'll do it myself but anyways okay um I was annoyed as fuck um but i'm training a new girl tonight so i just like you guys know or maybe you don't i can't do it in this mirror i am an assistant manager and i'm gonna be training a new girl tonight and i just i fucking literally i literally literally hate training people like i just hate it because First of all, I feel bad that they're like a new person, right? Like I'm like, ugh, like that sucks for you. Like, do you know what I mean? Like that sucks for you. Like you're a new person and obviously they're gonna do stuff wrong, right? Like over and over, which is like, I'm not, I'm not, like, I'm not saying it in a bad way to them. I just mean like, obviously they don't know cause they're training and it's just, I cannot, I cannot be like the bitch boss at work. Like I, I cannot, I cannot tell people what to do because I just feel like even if I say it in like the nicest way possible I feel like no matter what it's just gonna come off like so fucking bitchy and I just I cannot fathom coming off like that do you know what I mean like I'm like no I'm not gonna be that girl I have no idea I tried to film a get ready with me the other day and when I was doing that and I didn't end up liking the video but when I was doing that I said I was like Okay, it looks so fucking just natural, normal, blended in person. I guess it doesn't look that bad. It looks weird on camera. I don't know. It looks like normal as fuck. So I would just keep it very, very natural. Just a little bit. So we're done with that. And then I'm going to go in with my eyebrows. I have a new favorite brow product, by the way. Um, Elf Instant Lift Brow Pencil. I use this in the shade... Hey, it's not telling me but it's like a dark brown basically and then i go over it with the great lash clear shit i don't think that it holds the brows very well um so i'm gonna try something else so like that's like probably like i don't like recommend it you know but i'm gonna try like the little like you know how people have been using the got to be hair like spiking gel on their eyebrows I think i'm gonna try that because everyone says it works really well and my eyebrows just like do not stay in place like they don't they don't stay in place with that stuff either oh my god when i was at work today these like guys came in for like a like a business meeting and it was like this like this guy and his boss and you could tell the the kid he wasn't a kid but it was like a real like business job and um you could tell he was like new and like the the, the boss was just like fucking like ripping him to shreds basically he wasn't being mean but he was like basically like telling the kid like the shit he needs to work on and the kid i felt so bad he was like so like you could tell he's like one of those people that like cannot take like criticism like me me and like was getting really offended i was like oh my god this is like so sad but like also like the tea the tea i'm hearing right now um fucking i love tea um i have to get rid of these sideburns like i just i've got to do it got to do it okay so now we're gonna go with the skin i'm put uh my mascara on after i just try to say like mascara and shit for the very last minute because i feel like my lashes like have an issue with staying curl like they're just fucking annoying 
so we're gonna go with the skin i am going to go in with the same concealer the one size by um spongebob squarepants no i'm kidding patrick star and i'm just i just want to go over like where i get like pimples or like i didn't need to put that much okay um and i'm not gonna put any on my nose honestly like the leftover will go on my nose but i really do like to not put as like anything on my nose because then when i go in with blush i feel like it just like i don't really know what the word is like i feel like my nose already has a little bit natural like red to it and i feel like when i like what's the point of covering it with like concealer if that makes sense like because i'm just gonna put red over it after anyways like blush okay i put too much on my forehead but what the fuck what is too much really like does too much coverage exist okay actually it does exist i lied imagine me thinking like i can give like a makeup tutorial this is not a makeup tutorial by the way don't shut don't shut up now i'm gonna go in with the contour contour shut up girl literally shut up like like i know what i'm talking about i didn't say that this is the Fenty Beauty uh, matchstick in the shade Amber. And down here, like what the fuck is a double chin? The fuck? No, I don't have it. No, the fuck? No, I don't have a double chin. Idiot. And then I just go in with this um, Sonia Kashuk brush. I think it's a foundation brush, but I like using it for contour. And I just go ahead and put that in. Uh, I remember one time I went to Sephora when I was in like high school and this girl was like shade matching me and she was like applying it for me, right? And then when she applied the foundation, she like put like, um, like some like bronzer on me and I really liked the way it looked and I looked at the time and I didn't like, like I didn't know what the fuck bronzer was. Like, you know what I mean? Like, what the fuck is bronzer? You know what I mean? And so um, I looked at her and I was like, oh my God, like I actually really love what you just did. Like, um, what was that product? Like I never, I never use a bronzer before. And she's like, you don't use a bronzer? And I was like, no. She's like, then what do you use to warm up your face? And I was like, what do you use to fucking tone down that attitude, Miss Girl? No, 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 no. I was like, uh, nothing? Sorry, I'm natural. I don't know what to tell you. And then I go in with the Rare Beauty blush in the shade Joy. Honestly, I wish I would have gotten like the shade a little bit lighter so that I could like not have to be so careful about it because this shit is like. like y you can easily. That's probably too much. You can easily go overboard with the stuff. So, yeah, that's just like a recommendation. If you guys have like similar skin tone to me or even lighter, don't get that shade. What the fuck? What the fuck? You guys see what I'm talking about? It's like a little too much. Honestly, the thing is, is like, I always thought to myself, like, I want like a blush that's like, not too, like more strong, right? So I have to, but I don't really feel that way anymore. Like I'd rather have like a blush that's weaker just so I can go in and like build it up myself. But I mean, it's okay. I toned it down a little bit too much. You know what I mean? Like now I feel like I need to add like a little bit more. Do you see, like, I'm literally putting nothing. Um, did anyone else feel, okay, could you guys ever feel like you have, like, road rage? Where you started off, like, when you first, like, started learning to drive, you had, like, road rage? Like, I don't know. I feel like that, too. And now I feel like my road rage has just calmed down so much. Like, I feel like I'm just, like, like I feel like I've, like, churned. I like the blush to look like this. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I'm like, okay, like, I'm, mm, I don't have road rage anymore. You know what I mean? I don't know. Okay, and then 
we're almost done. I'm gonna put on some um, chapstick to sit on my lips while I do my eyelashes. I'm gonna use the Bl Bliss Text Hydrate shit. I actually really like this. It feels really nice. Um, okay. And then for the eyelashes, I'm going to use a lash curler and then sky high lash on the top lashes and then the L'Oreal telescopic on the bottom lashes. Okay. Not to sound like a cunt or anything, but my natural lashes are like long and they're dark. And they're great in that aspect. <laughs> but when it comes to curl, no. There's no, the fuck? I didn't curl them at all. Actually I did. Um, they just, there's no curl. They go straight down and they don't stay curled. So I've like tried everything, like obviously curling them before I put mascara on, using waterproof mascara, but these, they just like will not stay curled. The Sky High mascara though, the one I'm using right now, is like the closest I've ever come to them like holding their curl, honestly. Like they're long. Um, okay, and then I use this one on the bottom lashes. I don't know. I just really like the way this makes my bottom lashes look. And yeah, like look how long. God. Okay, and then I'm gonna do the same on this side over here. Um, I feel like my tips will get so good once I stop wearing a mask. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, oh my god, like, hmm. So the lashes are done. And then I'm gonna go in lastly and do the lips, which for a long time I would actually not put anything on my lips because, first of all, I don't really like the way just anything feels on my lips but um i found products that don't really feel like they're wearing anything on your lips so i think that's why i put stuff on my lips now I just have to figure out charlotte tilbury lip liner in the shade iconic nude and then i'm going to okay well, i'll show you guys after so i don't like i'm not doing this part on camera i don't really like overline my lips really like I kind of just go along the out and I might like fill in my cupid's bow a bit. I'll show you, like, hold on, let me just. So that's what they look like just with the like lip liner on the outside. I didn't put it on the inside or anything. Well, I went like that, but whatever. And then I'm gonna go in with this Revlon cream lipstick in the shade Bare It All. And that's the lip. And that is all that I do for my makeup. Let me go into like. A little different of lighting this lighting is just like i cannot find good fucking lighting in this house okay yeah so this is what it looks like my eyelashes actually do look really good um see like that brow gel just like does not work for shit yeah so this is the final look it's really easy it does not take long at all i have zero talent but i do really like the products that i've been using lately so thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video